Hello everyone, how are you? I hope you're doing fine. So without wasting any time, we are straight away going to do our today's math homework. So again, we are watching video part four of the chapter number work. And today we are going to learn about odd numbers and even numbers. I know we already know what odd numbers and even numbers are, but anyway, we are going to practice so that we don't forget in grade five. All right. Uh, so we know that an even number can be grouped by two. So an even number always has a partner and an odd number cannot be grouped by two, which means an odd number does not have a partner. So we see we have one burger here. Uh, so it has no partner, but it, there are two burgers here. So they are in a group of two and they are partner, correct? Which means one is an odd number and two is an even number. All right, easy, I know. Moving on, we're gonna see if we can make partners or not. So we have one car over here and it has no partner. So no partner means it is an odd number, right? There are two butterflies here and we see both of them can be grouped into because obviously there are two of them. So it is an even number. There are three stars here. Let's start grouping them. So I start grouping two of them here. So there are the partner, but this one is left alone. So it has no partner and cannot be grouped by two. So this is an odd number. Likewise, there are four frogs here. Partner, two of them are partner and two of them are partner. Amazing, so four is an even number. We see we have five hearts here. Let's start grouping in pairs of two. Two of them here, two of them here. And this one heart is left alone and it has no partner which means it is an odd number. It is not an even number. We see six chicks here. So we're gonna start grouping them in groups of two. Pairs of two partner, pairs of two partner, and pairs of two partner. We see no one's left alone and everyone has a partner and a pair is in a pair of two. So this is an even number. We see seven ice creams here. Let's start grouping them. So. Partner, partner, partner. Oh my God, this does not have a partner, which means it cannot be grouped in a pair of two. So this is an odd number. We see rats here. Let's start grouping these eight rats. Partner in pair of two, partner in pair of two, partner in pair of two, and partner in pair of two. Okay. So we see there are four groups of two. So this is an even number. We see there are nine trees here. Let's start grouping them. Partner, 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 partner. Oh my God, this does not have a partner. So this is an odd number. There are 10 moons here. Let's start partnering up the moons in groups of two. Partner in pair of two, 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 and partner in pair of two. Amazing! We see these all have partners and they have, these 10 moons have been grouped into groups of two. So they are even numbers. So we know one is an odd number. We know two is an even number. Three is an odd number. Four is an even number. Five is an odd number, six is an even number, seven is an odd number, eight is an even number, nine is an odd number, and ten is an even number. That was very, very easy, isn't it, friends? Moving on, what about the numbers which are bigger than ten? Suppose we have the number, suppose we have the number 142. Now we can't start making groups of 142, right? 
so we're going to look at the last digit which is the units digit so units digit has the number 2 and we know 2 is an even number so 142 is an even number what about this number 135 let's look at the last digit which is the units place units place has the digit 5 we know 5 is an odd number so 135 is an odd number what about the number 100 we're going to look at the last digit which is the units place we know 10 is an even number and what is the last digit of 10 so 0 0 0 so this is an even number so we know every number which has 2 4 um, six, eight, and zero in its units place is an even number. I repeat every number which has two, four, six, eight, and zero in its units place is an even number. Let's solve these questions. So we know two, four, six, eight, zero at units place will be an even number. So let's try solving these questions. Let's read the question. Find the number if it is find if the number is even or odd okay so we know we are supposed to look at the last place which is units place units place has three and three we know is an odd number so this is an odd number let's look at this number 1428 units place has eight and we see eight is an even number so i'm going to write here even simple the number we have next is 1000 we have zero in units place and we know that zero is an even number so i'm going to write here even 5869 what is there in the units place units place has nine we know nine is not an even number nine is an odd number so we're going to write here odd 1252 we know 2 is definitely an even number because it is already a 2 so i'm going to write here even quickly do this in your notebook pause the video and write this in your notebook quickly 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 hush hush i'm going to remove it now and move to the next slide we're going to practice this ourselves odd or even we have only three questions so we're going to write this in our notebook, take a picture and send it to Didi quickly. So the question, uh, numbers we have are 9,202, 8,763, 4,500. We have to write if these numbers are even or odd. Moving on. That's it. Today we're going to study this much only. Didi is going to send a worksheet in the WhatsApp group very quickly. So it will be a very short worksheet. And along with the worksheet, we're also doing these questions and these questions. So five questions here, three questions here, eight, and there'll be 10 questions in the worksheet. So 18 questions we are gonna do and send it to Didi quickly, all right? Okay, that's it. Also remember the deadline to submit the work is tonight, 8 p.m. So everybody who submits before 8 p.m. tonight is going to get a star in the leaderboard. So all the best, have fun, bye-bye.